the southern tip of Vancouver Island, we find the beautiful city of Victoria. And just outside of that, a suburb, the Langford community, which is where we find Starlight Stadium. It is the final match in the second week of the Canadian Premier League's fifth season. Two very strong 11s, both for James Merriman and Tommy Wielden Jr.'s side. The Tridents in their 4-3-3 once again, led by James Merriman. Emil Gazdoff is the goalkeeper. Eric Lajeunesse makes his first start for Pacific. For Cavalry, no doubt a bitter taste in their mouth. This is a side that always plays well, but always plays better when they're hungry and a little bit ticked off as they look to get the better of Pacific in league play and climb out of seventh in the CPL table. And there goes Eric Lajeunesse of Ottawa, Ontario for Reed across the herd, settled down Josh Hurd. Fires from about eight yards away. Long commitment from Tommy Wilden Jr. and the staff to Daly, signed to 2024 with an option for 25 as well. It's Moosey, cuts that back well, opens up his hips to the back post, bouncing around, it's off as Gazdoff and in. Gote and Tinyi with a brilliant vertical run to that back post. Well, we talked about consistency with Ali Moosey Ali and showing off his magic, he gets some help from the post and Gazdoff. It's 1 0 for Cavalry. Ali Moussi is good as anyone in the league in these situations when he can isolate a fullback one-on-one. -on -one. Even when he's not really running at pace here, he's just got such good feet. Salouf high lofted this time. It's going to sit up. A second effort. Now a crossover for Hurd. Incredible vertical. Salouf driving cross. Can't find a teammate. Yates up towards La Jeunesse. It is met by the soaring Josh Hurd. Chima under pressure from Reed. Del wide in return to Saints. Takes it away, it's Josh Hurd running in for Reed! Great stop from Carducci. The reaction to the right and just enough to lift that high and wide. Cut back from Yates. Salouf keeps it in play for Hurd. Well done on the defensive end, but it's not done! Cavalry fall asleep, and Avon Salouf says, I'll take that! Everyone with hands in the air just gave up on the play, and Tommy Wilden Jr., who is a man who has preached play to the whistle with this team before. But just as we begin to sing the praises of Ayman Salouf folly, he gets his first for the Tridents. You called Adam. Bielwa, show him the pressure from Daly. Ozzy to New Zealander in return. Jesse Daly onto his right foot. Daly! Salouf into the attacking third, gets air to bite again. His cross up. Oh, Daniels! But he had a fantastic four years with the Whitecaps. Well, Salouf. Leaves it for Dada Luke. Easton Ungaro, poor touch, but back for Young. He bobbles it. Ungaro has it blocked by Klump, and Daly sends it away. Now we're starting to see that energy deplete, and Cavalry with their subs start to be a little bit more of the protagonist. Mane fakes the cross, opens up. Mason careful not to foul, but does enough to throw Mane off of his rhythm. Now Mukum Bielwa punched away by Marco Carducci. Sits for Selu towards Daniels. No clear lane towards goal. Izri Rudolph is going to tell Marco Kurdici to play it as whistles off his wrist. And that's full time, ladies and gentlemen. It's mission accomplished for Tommy Wielden Jr. Would have loved a couple of extra points, but he will be more than satisfied to have an undefeated road trip to start the season. He and James Merriman come over to congratulate each other and say, see you in July, the next time these two sides will meet.